This is my real life dog, Chester. <laughs> and this is my Minecraft dog, Woof Swag. Big difference, right? I mean, I really love my dog, and we have a really good bond. We like walk together, and I could call him my best friend. Talking about friends, this is Prince Zam. Also, a really good friend. Um. What swag is that, Al? <laughs> <laughs> and now, this is me without a dog. And to be fair, he did feel really bad after killing my dog, but I just can't let this pass. I mean, killing someone's dog is like an act for war. But am I really going to waste a full week of preparation just to get revenge? Well, I mean... Why not? So I set up a 5 step plan where I'm not going to harm Zam, but really just bully him. And so step 1 was to get Zam to fall in love with a Minecraft fox. Don't doubt my methods. And after I got my new dog, Twoof Swag, we eventually found a fox for him. Oh, there's a fox right here, hold on. He is he is stuck in the berry bush. This one is a idiot. Up the up okay. Wait, 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 guys, guys, let's find this, let's test something out, let's test something out. Wait, so do you guys not have leads? I do yeah, have no. leads. You got him? Oh my god! He's got the lead in his mouth, and then he has another lead. Oh He's my god, leads. that's, that's awesome. so goofy. And so now that I've completed step one, it was time for step two, where I would actually kill his fox. Except Zam would never get attached to a Minecraft pixel. And so that got me thinking on what I could do. But obviously, it would never work if I just asked him to take care of his fox. Oh, and so he streamed for two plus hours talking about how much he loved this fox. <laughs> what a fool. Anyways, um, I have a, I have, I have a pet fox. His name is Jesus. I love Jesus. He's, he's my homie. God, I love Jesus. Oh my God, this is so cool. Spoke would like Jesus. I want Spoke to see Jesus. Spoke will be like, yeah, that's Jesus. 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 I love this song. I guess that you can say that he loves his fox. So now it was time to get rid of him. Obviously, I didn't kill him, because that would be mean. But for some reason, Ashwa could fly and accidentally killed his fox. And that made Zam really sad, which made him even more secure about his other pets. So for step three, it was actually time to take one of his other pets as hostage. Don that too. But I don't know how to do that, so I asked my good friend Don Turn to help me out. If you don't know Don, he's bald and a lot smarter than I am. So he was definitely fit for the job. And so we went to work. Welcome we're, we're evil, we're evil, to man. Zam's... Basement. I've been watching the, the blueprint of this whole base, so now I know exactly where his pet is. And coincidentally, it's right over here. Don the two. Psst, psst, psst. Come on, two? Don the two. Let's go. Boat. Yes. Yeah, there we All go. right, Boat. let's go. Thank you. Go, 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 go. I'm going. I'm go, going. Go, 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 go. Pull it. No. Uh -oh. No, Peggy. No! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I don't know what to do. I don't uh, know what to do. What's going on? What's oh going God. on? You are in the elevator. You are in the elevator. I don't elevator. know what's going Drinks. on. Drinks. Uh, is, is the cat dead? <laughs> Where did the cat go? Uh-oh. See, this was a problem. Because if we didn't have one of his pets as hostage, Zam would never show up for step 4 and 5. So we did what most intellectual people would do. And we tamed a new cat, naming him Donda Tree. I mean... Donata tree. But you might be wondering where we would take him. Well, we abducted him on my UFO, where I would also set up step four, which took me quite a while. I basically built a little trap under the UFO where if Zam would be walking under, a big trap door would open with 25 full diamond geared baby zombies falling on him. But obviously, for getting all the needed supplies, I needed a lot of emeralds. And luckily, I knew just the right guy to call. Radunes. Hello. Hello, Radunes. Welcome to Socking. <laughs> Alright. Alright. So you're telling me. You need some of these. I, I need some of these. Yeah, and well, I know you're pretty you know, rich, so. I am. I am extravagantly wealthy. You are correct. <laughs> and after a little small talk, we finally agreed on a good deal. What if, you know, we just like, you know, you you offer a heart or two as collateral until you pay me back. And, and now I'm talking about actual like trading, you know, not like borrowing. I know you could get those two stacks very easy. Um, All right. So how about one heart for two stacks of emeralds? Yeah, sure, sure. You oh, want perfect. this, right? That is correct. All right. All right, that sounds cool. Here you go. I just want to make sure this works. Mm -hmm. It is a heart. Wow. This is actually, I'm going to get to 20 hearts again. Damn, okay. Wait, can you <laughs> get those? All right, thank you for... Um, uh, those emerald hug, blocks, hug, hug. I appreciate it. <laughs> and so now that I could trade armor with villagers, the trap could be completed. But this was obviously not to kill him, because we don't do that here. No, this was mainly to scare him off for step 5. But to get them to the UFO, I had to convince him to follow me, which wasn't too hard. 
All right, Sam. Yeah. So okay. basically, um, you, mm. we've been talk we've been talking about this with uh, yeah. you, me, and Don. And basically, I had this mm. plan where we could just form a, a tree pact, like the Three Musketeers and stuff, and we yeah. fight people. Like, okay. uh, just you remember when we um, when we killed when we killed Clutch? Yeah. Just out of nowhere, because that was funny. That was really cool. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Um, we did count. That's true. So well, that's awesome. <laughs> Yeah, I've been working on this. Um, so what Where's do you Don? think of it? Uh, Don, That's where cool. are you? Uh, like I'm, I should be there very soon. What I didn't mention is that Don Turned is already on top of the UFO, ready to pull the lever and activate the trap, which you should do right around now. You have those grain circles? Oh, oh my god! god. Bombs away! <laughs> oh my god! No, no, no. Wow. And not surprisingly, he pulled out. And because of that, he gave me two options. Either I could chase him down, or I could continue with step five, where I would reveal to Zam that the sket was stationed at the UFO, ready to be sent into outer space. And I think that you could already tell what I did. You're gonna run, right? All right. I've, I've thought of this. Yeah. I've thought of this. Yeah. Yeah. Y you can run. Uh, you remember your, uh, your cat being gone? Oh, yeah. It's in the UFO. Yeah, bro. It's gone, agree. bro. You should want to come back. I'm just saying. You might want to come back, Sam. You should come back. This is so Sam, silly. Sam, you remember when you um Cat. killed my dog? Yeah, I remember. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of want to get revenge. And so now that Sam knew that he had no other choice than to return to the UFO, it was only a matter of time until I would get my revenge. But Sam is smart, and he also knew that that would happen. So while we were waiting for Sam to show up, Sam went back to his base, getting ready for a fight over his pet cat. He's here! Pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it! Pull it, pull it! The what? There he goes! <laughs> Sam, uh -oh. you shouldn't have oh, tried shit. doing this. You shouldn't have tried doing this. Yeah? We could have talked business. We could have definitely talked business. That's something yeah. you wanted to do? Yeah! I'm sorry, Sam. I'm really sorry. Oh, Sam, you shouldn't have done this. You shouldn't have done this. Get him! How many hearts do you have now, anyhow? Uh, nine. Nice. <laughs> Good job, Sam. Good job. Are you running? No, you're not gonna no. run. I would never. You're not gonna run. I would never run. Sam, it's over. That sounds absurd. You are that definitely running absurd. right now. I'm, I'm, I'm just no, saying. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> And with Zam running away and me and Don chasing him, it meant that we had won the war. And even though we lost him during the chase, it was still really funny. <laughs> Get in! Don, why are you chasing <laughs> my Don, you're the worst! Oh, and if you're still watching, make sure to subscribe. It would mean a lot to me. Also, YouTube thinks you would like this video. So, let's see if they're right.